Learning English, Grammar Fundamentals, Nouns and Pronouns. Welcome to our English language learning video series. In this episode, we will delve into the fascinating world of pronouns, specifically focusing on indefinite pronouns. Understanding indefinite pronouns is essential for effective communication in English, so let's dive right in. Indefinite pronouns are a type of pronoun that do not refer to a specific person, thing, or amount. They are used when we want to refer to someone or something in a general or non-specific way. Indefinite pronouns can be singular or plural, and they play a crucial role in making our language more versatile. Some common examples of indefinite pronouns include someone, anyone, everybody, everything, nobody, nothing, each, either, neither. Singular indefinite pronouns refer to one person or thing. When using singular indefinite pronouns, it is important to remember that they require singular verb forms. Examples of singular indefinite pronouns and their corresponding verb forms. Someone wants to speak with you. Wants, singular verb form. Anybody can learn English. Can, singular verb form. Each student should bring their textbook. Should bring, singular verb form. Plural indefinite pronouns, as the name suggests, refer to more than one person or thing. When using plural indefinite pronouns, we need to use plural verb forms. Examples of plural indefinite pronouns and their corresponding verb forms. Some want to join the club. Want, plural verb form. Many have already completed the assignment. Have, plural verb form. Both teams played well. Played, plural verb form. Some indefinite pronouns can be used with either singular or plural verb forms, depending on the context. Examples of indefinite pronouns with both singular and plural verb forms. All is forgiven. Is, singular verb form. All are welcome to join. Are, plural verb form. Some of the cake has been eaten has, singular verb form. Some of the cookies have been baked. Have, plural verb form. Congratulations! You've now gained a solid understanding of indefinite pronouns in English. Remember to practice using them in your conversations and written work to enhance your language skills. Keep up the great work, and stay tuned for more exciting grammar fundamentals in our English language learning series. Happy learning!